Hey everybody, welcome back. Or if you're new here, welcome. We are, I'm so excited. We just, we've been doing three, the last three of Midnight Mass back to back and we are in the last and final episode of this series. Mm-hmm. What is it entitled, dear? We did not look at Let's that. Let's look. Oh, I have it in my notes. Hold on. Okay. This one is Revelation. Just Revelation? Mm-hmm. So, episode seven, Revelation. Well, we ended with a mass chaos in the church, which you knew was going to happen. They cut the power. It was literally a massacre. Yeah. They cut the power. All the boats they hid. They did. They did. Su- uh, Sturge and stupid mayor ass. Sorry, and look at it. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Bev the dumbass. And then they were all in it together. So nobody had any access. They're trapped on the island. <clears throat> they go into church. He gives the, the weirdest sermon ever. Some of them freak out. He's poisoning them. They all, most of them take the drink, not the smart ones. Mm -hmm. And then literal chaos ensues. And then the beast showed up and swept off Millie. Took her away. She literally got snatched up by him. Yeah. And then Bev was cowering where the communion wine was. And so the remaining ones, again, are Sarah, Aaron. Lisa. Lisa. Riley's brother. The mom. Yeah, the mom of Riley. Mm -hmm. And. Did you say Sheriff? And Sheriff. Yes, so they had fled. They had a five-minute head start. We don't know what's going to happen. There are going to be more deaths, I'm sure. But Bev the bitch. Well, if you watched the last one, you know how I feel about her. Anyways, should we go? Oh, yeah. before we go, sorry. I'm so excited oh. to watch this one. <laughs> a huge shout-out to our patrons. You guys are rock stars. You're amazing. We love you. Oh, wait, mine looks fucked up. There no, you go. Mine looks goofy. Mine looks like, there we go. Um, and we appreciate you from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you, thank you. So, I'm super excited. As you can, as you can see, I was scared as shit at the beginning of this yeah. series. I was. And now I'm so, like, passionately mad about it. <laughs> it's because every, everybody in this town's a dumbass, except for the ones that didn't drink it. Yes. Yes. And poor Liza. Lisa. Lisa. I felt so bad seeing her parents. Parents. Like, and then Mayor went rogue on that guy. It was a girl. A girl, yeah. He, like, threw it out a couple times. I'm like, whoa, awesome. calm down, Mayor. Mayor be thirsty. Um, so, and I don't know. Monsignor's laying on the floor. I don't know what it was. When she literally, he was literally just agreeing with her when she was like, oh, he said this, and he was like, no. And he's like, she's like, I love him, but if anyone follows it up with but, a but, they don't agree with the, what they're mm-hmm. saying prior. So, um, anyway, ready, set, here we go. Yes. Enjoy. <laughs> Just stay calm. Keep me calm this episode, girl. Is this how I'm going to feel at the end of it? Stranger Things too? Probably. She looks younger yet. Well, she just got baked, so let's yeah. take that into consideration. She's going to be like five after we're done with this, at the end of this one. It's probably about the age she met Monsignor, maybe. Damn, Millie. Girl, from the way you started. Mm-hmm. Good heavens. Yeah, she was basically dust at the beginning. Oh, yeah? Does it it ever hurt you? Yes. Walking dead with vampires over here. And if he kills his wife, I'm like, look at it. Mask, literally. (laughs) God, it's like, how can you hide from this? Where are we gonna go? To the church to get my son. He's still in the church. No, he's not. Well, what did they do to him? Daddy. You, what happened to what my did dad? They do? I don't know. You, you said you studied this thing, all right? You, you said you had samples. I didn't. I, 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 quiet, I, I don't want it. My God, I'm so nervous for them. Ew, no, no. Does anyone have service? Oh my God, they're gonna come through the window at you. I have a canoe by the upwards. I, I mean, I don't think it gets anybody to the mainland, but off the island, at least. My parents? My parents are out there. They'd have to come with us, right? No, honey. Get them to a doctor. There's room. On the fishing boats, there's plenty of room. That's not what I'm talking about. Oh, well, she's not talking about leaving. Because they come right after us, like Bev said. That's why they didn't sink them. That's why they just pulled some plugs. Because they need the boats. A 
knife isn't, nothing's going to help though. I mean, I guess they need any weapon they can to like kind of um, stall them. And it might come down to just minutes. Maybe seconds. It's about everyone else in the world. Dying for people we haven't even met. No greater love than that. You. That's what the good book says, isn't it? Windows. Oh. Oh my god. <gasps> Again. So we can find the house. Aaron Green! I'd like to finish our discussion! You go. You get those children to safety. I'd like a word with Beth. Mom! I love you. Mom, so much. Mom. Hey, Flynn. I just want to have a little chat with Aaron Green <clears throat> and Sarah Gunning. Maybe that terror-loving sheriff, if he's still with them. Yeah. They're all in there. Two children, two. The children will be fine. They're already saved. You don't think I would ever put those children in any real danger. Really, you can't. The rest of them. You needed to hear this. Oh, good. Come, go, girl. Now I like you. You again. aren't a good person. Well, that was uncalled for. God doesn't love you more than anyone else. You aren't a hero. And you certainly, certainly aren't a victim. A drunk. And a murderer was evidence of the quality of See, his See, she parent. turns it on other he people. Was. It's never her. Every part of him. God loves him. Yep. Just as much as he loves you, Bev. Why does that upset you so much? Just the idea that God loves everyone. Yes, amen, girl. You Just preach it now. Just as much as you. Jesus. She'll be up and about in no time. Again, it's true. She wants God to just love her, nobody else. Mm -hmm. love it. It's, it's not the way it works. What it's like for God. Every moment of every hour of every day, a deluge of death. It's so loud, how, how could he hear? It was you. It was you. And Sarah, that's why I did it. That's why I put that thing in that trunk. That's why I... I bribed and lied and smuggled it back here. The, the, that was the reason I didn't want you to die. And Sarah, I mean, our whole lives have been wasted. And I mean, just like staring across the church. You know, too scared to come down and be with you. I mean, too scared to tell our own daughter the truth. Daughter Wolf, no, she was never a sin. See, never I, I called it, did I not? Mm -hmm. Never. What could we have done? John, it was a different world. You, if you would just show up and ask me, I would have taken this collar off and I would have gone with you. I would have gone with you anywhere in the world. I didn't do that, John. Not to you, or to her. Not to him. Mm. Not after the war. Smell Flynn, good. that's his way. Like, you smell amazing. Back up. Raghead. Oh God, Lisa, Lisa, no. <laughs> Do that. It doesn't matter. She didn't want to turn into one of you yeah. all. Who built the fires? It's going said? too big. It's probably going to turn out. Oh. I mean, the whole island. With this go. wind, it's like a tinderbox. The whole yeah. thing could burn to nothing like an 84. It's with the blood, and they were hurled to the earth, and a third of the earth was burned up, and a third of the trees were burned up, and all of the green it's grass the tiny was burned bird. up. Yeah. As for the cowardly. She thinks she's so Sorry. fucking special. Yeah. 
She thinks she's his favorite. All and that God should love everybody else. And she's like, perfect. A new flood. A flood of fire. Come with me. They're gonna go go to the church? Well then the best thing would be to set the dang church on fire. Well they're in Joe's cabin, aren't they? Mm-hmm. I mean his trailer. What's the point? Minutes. So true, Lisa. That's not what I said. I'm saying either way, we're gonna be okay. But she drank it too, no, so No, she didn't. No, but the wine. Yeah, but she didn't drink the last one. Yeah. She didn't have the seizure that Bun Senior Pruitt had. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's all mine. Same. It's all mine, too. They're... what they're doing to me. Kids made it to the boat. I hope so too. We're never gonna know, are we? Probably not. So they can't get anywhere else. Yeah, that's smart. I've been somewhere. We focused on that house tomorrow. Yeah. Oh god, the wing guy. It's like, what do you do? Start on fire. It's like, go away. Ah. Hurry up, baby girl. Set it on fire. They really think they're going to be saved by the church, so they're basically going to kill themselves. That's what they're going to do. Monsignor, you are a stronger soul than I. But if you forgive men their trespass, the she Heavenly her. Father will also forgive you. Face. So, who am I to judge? Still. It's an ark. She's so stupid. I set up cots in the rec center for those Baby who are Joe, chosen. It's not an ark. We will take to our ships, to our vessels, it's a and then wooden like a sheep that's among wolves, like you said. Old as hell. We will spread the good word. And and, and who, who will decide who's chosen? We will. No. I'm sorry. No, we got this wrong. I don't be ridiculous. No, Beverly, please look at them. We are the wolves. No. They need leadership. Look at them. They're, they're lost without a leader, without a shepherd. That must be you, Monsignor. It has to be no, you. No, you want to be the shepherd. It has always been you. No, it was never me. That's the thing about priesthood. It's never supposed to be about me. It's, about it's supposed to be about God. Well, I suppose it isn't you anymore. Oh, I was going to say it's me. Of course, he told us that, didn't he? Jesus himself, he warned us against the scribes, against the priests in Matthew. Do not call anyone on earth father. You have one father and he is in heaven. They're walking like slow like zombies, aren't they? Monsignor Pruitt, did it have to be true of you? I suppose virtue isn't a virtue if it doesn't cost you anything. And it was always going this way. You were always... You were always going to be the last, the hardest test of my faith, you. Stumbling block to me, for you are setting your mind not on divine things, Gosh. but on human things. 
Babylon the Great, mother of whores and all of Earth's abominations. I truly hope you two enjoy the sunrise. I hope somebody calls up. See, she keeps reflecting. She's the worst one of all. I say it every mm -hmm. time. So now she wants to be the leader. What's wrong? Nothing. We're ready for them. Hold them outside a few more minutes. We need an accurate head count so we know how many boats we need tomorrow. They, they burn the boats. Call back the ferries. He'll just call them back when it's Burnt time. them too. They who? Keep them safe. You think that bird died up from the vampire? The, no, Amen. My mom and my dad and my brother. They're all gone, aren't they? Yeah. We just have each other, honey. Okay. Who's that now? Is that Howard? Howard Hobbs. Look at the state of you. Must have had a hell of a time of it. You poor, poor man. See, it is, she's like a cult you know, leader. I don't think I ever saw you at mass a day in your life. And yet, you were blessed tonight, weren't you? I killed my Julie tonight. You killed your wife. I hope they turn on her. I you hope know, they turn. I hate to tell you this, but you... <laughs> could have brought them back Just turn on her easily in fact if you had been a man of faith oh my god all those days you turned your back on god well the tools for your salvation were Everybody always you don't have to physically be in the church you can worship at home too. wherever you don't have to be in a church well you Bev. just didn't no room for him inside i'm afraid i saved him bev he was always nice to me. I'm sorry. What? I was thinking maybe um, just go for go for a walk. Why is this asshat maybe, still uh, listening to her? <laughs> I'm glad he's having a change of heart after all this, but he opened the door to this mess. Bring him in. I'll come in St. Patrick's. All are welcome! Yeah. All have to be welcome or this isn't really a God's house! Oh shitties. Well, he did have a point. Everyone is welcome. Bev just selectively chooses whoever she mm -hmm. wants. You go out the back through the vestibule head for the water. He's gonna set it on that fire. That was the idea. I, I've been so proud of you and I just wish, I just wish that, that we had gotten to know each other. And I have a Me feeling. too. Out the back. I'll take care. <gasps> Dirge. Dirge. She was gonna. Bummer. Oh. Don't do that to my kid. It's almost sad right now. She doesn't want it. She doesn't want it. Place on the whole island was that little bridge by the marsh. They're gonna put it by the bridge. Oh God! Of course, Ben's gonna shoot. Terrorist. Yeah. We can put it I just can't let you have No, because she's a racist. She's like, fucker. Surprised you made your move when it was empty, coward. It's not though, is it? Who's the coward here? Ah! Drop it, Aaron. Just drop it. Ah! Yeah, throw it ah! No! Oh. Ah! Throw it in because you did that to his dad. Do it, hey. to me. 
Nobody's gonna listen to you. Go listen to you. Please don't, boy. No. Yep. Boom. Yeah. You don't know how fuck with his dad. That's right. Nobody <laughs> screws with him like that. I think it's gonna burn down anyway. Yeah. This verse in the Bible just kind of stuck with me. He makes the sunrise on the evil and the good. <laughs> Sunrise on the path. Yeah. yeah. Yep. So we can't do it to anybody else. They, they went out here always. Mm -hmm. There's got to be uh, somewhere. There's, there's got to be somewhere no. else. No. Yeah, no. There's nowhere else. Really? Now you all. Where, where else can we go? There's got to be somewhere else. There's not. She's gonna die and go to hell, lady. The boats are gone, Beth. Kid, you okay? I don't think so. I don't know, but I think I killed my mom. Aww. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I done, done some stuff tonight that I feel I done some stuff. So they're feeling guilty. What Bev doesn't, I mean, what... Will you uh, forgive me, kid? Sorry. Ooh, sorry. Bev doesn't have guilt. Mm -hmm. I'll forgive you. Well, he was a decent guy. He just got sucked into this. I know, but he's taking Holly with him. I know. <laughs> She's like, bitch, I'm dead. You're dead. You're dead. Take him. Oh, the sun, yeah. Do you that's think right. I can make it for the sunrise? 30 miles. I mean, that thing can barely fly it. No, I, I don't think it can. What? Remember, he said they were both in the boat? When we die, oh. what happens? Is he there? Myself. Myself. That's the problem. That's the whole problem with the whole thing. That word. Oh. Lightning bolts like fireworks inside. And I thought I'd despair or feel afraid, but I don't feel any of that. None of it. Because I'm too busy. I'm too busy in this moment. This matter, this body, is mostly just empty space, after all. And solid matter, it's just energy vibrating very slowly. And there is no me. Energy, not memory, not self. My name, my personality, my choices all came after me. I am the lightning that jumps between. I am the energy firing the neurons and... I'm returning. Everyone who's ever been, every plant, every animal, every atom, every star, every galaxy, all of it. More galaxies in the universe than grains of sand on the beach. And that's what we're talking about when we say God. I always do. I always forget my dreams. But now, in the split second, in the moment I remember, the instant I remember, I comprehend everything at once. And I am all of it. I am everything. I am all. I am that I am. Still, my soul shall be. 
alone. That's what you get. Yeah. A cruel way she deserved. senior was just like he had said like I'm the dad and like I wish we would have got to know each other and you know he was like go ahead like set it up on fire whatever and then Sturgeon shoots her like then that's when he realized I mean then he I bum rushed him but that's when he realized this was what we were doing was not okay I mean he did not unlock this hell they went through he realized once they went after his kid that they unlocked like yes that they just took everything the wrong way. Yes. Because first people that they were, um, for the way they were supposedly saying that they were Christians, yeah. the way they were acting wasn't like... That wasn't that way. I think that's what that meant to come down, was maybe that they had gone up to heaven, and maybe it was like the, do you think the white stuff coming down? I mean, it was, I heard of the quote they gave Riley. Which one? When you return to dust. Oh, yes, yes. But did you see how they smoothly turned? But she, like, really was like, um, Bev? I don't think she was going where everybody else was going. Because the ones singing were the true believers. They were just stupid and following It was her. just blind faith. I mean, I think they had good intentions. They yeah. just went a completely different. Well, they left her at that point where she was like, oh. I know, no but way. I'm saying I think they had complete opposite intentions yes. of what oh, that yeah. was. They just went a wrong way. They hit him once he saw people eating each other. Oh, the kid? Yeah, like yeah. the last episode. Oh, yeah. When he saw people turning on each other. No, but then when Bev was going off, like, why would we eat you, like, your dirty blood and, and you're a terrorist? And it's like, well, we knew she was racist and all that I know, but he started joke. seeing it when he saw people eating and the other people who didn't go. Well, it, it was... No, I'm saying he realized, but then he really came to the realization once they went after his dad. Right. Well, it was the same with Ed and Annie. Mm -hmm. They weren't going to do anything. They were resisting because they saw everything. That and he, I, they would have felt guilty Yeah. if they would have done something. You see, like, even Sturgeon and the other little boy that was the other kid that was the altar, not the little boy, but the altar. was like, I think I they, killed my mom. They felt the guilt. It's something Bev never felt. Mm -hmm. Bev never felt guilt. And even when Monsignor was, to, Monsignor was talking to Riley and he said he didn't have any guilt at first, the guilt hit him. Hit him at the end here because it was and his daughter. he took off his collar. Yeah, he threw it in the water. I'm glad, I'm glad at least, it was sad with um, how that damn bird got a... Uh, but he died because she looked, she didn't control the She was distract. no, 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 um, she was, just, yeah, Aaron was distracting it so she could cut the wings to save, but yeah, it died. Yeah, it so it sucks that she couldn't feel the legs, but she couldn't feel the legs, meaning nobody else has to die. Yeah, because of that. I'm glad it was the kids, those two kids lived, like, at least... But they were like buds, and I think they kind of maybe had a little crush on each other or whatever, right? But they were friends, and, like, they were just, oh, my God. I was glad, though, that Bird didn't get them, or the um, the vampirish, whatever. Mm -hmm. When they were in that house or that barn when it was yeah. eating it. Oh. Um, yeah, that was emotional at the end. I think, I mean, I got emotional, but then when they started singing, it hit me again, when she, Annie started singing. I also started um, 
tearing up when he was taking his dad to the beach. Oh my gosh, I know. And then he laid his hand upon, well, he had died first, right? Yeah. Yeah, he was shot like freaking Bev. Twice. And then Bev, all alone, not singing no hymns, was she? Because she didn't feel love for anybody. No, she didn't. At least when they went out, they had somebody, everybody else, yeah. you know? Yes, exactly. Or they had their, the group, the, you know, the ones that were single had the group. But then, I mean, and then she even had the nerve to be like, you're a whore to uh, Millie. Like mm -hmm. when they're, and I'm like, what? Like, Bro, who cares? You weren't even alive. I'm glad Annie kind of got some words out that what she said that everyone else hasn't t said out loud, mm -hmm. but what we think basically, like, you are not without sin. You've been, every time you make a racial mar uh, uh, slur, Every time you call someone a whore, anytime you, they're, you're sinning. And then with the way she turned on Monsignor, yeah. she was like, you don't believe what I'm believing? So now basically I'm the leader. Mm -hmm. And they were all kind of like, uh, you know, I don't, I mean, yeah. I'm just pissed that like Mayor and, and him had to be such jackasses. I mean, I know Erin died alone, but she also thought of Riley. So that kind of what is what carried her. That was, yeah. To death, you know. Oh, they'll meet again. Um, you know, I mean, in that afterlife. I was hoping he would have popped up and he'd have been like, oh, you know. She was kind of talking to him when she turned her head. Yeah, so maybe so, yeah. They just didn't show him. Um, but, yeah, that was smart to set stuff. I mean, it was, they really were trying to burn it down so that they could, es like, escape, right, mm -hmm. and go, you know, do it to another town. But, man, I'm glad they set their, that little community center on fire. I'm glad he threw that in and set that thing on fire. Um, and essentially what she was spewing to the, to the other guy, to Howie, like, oh, because you don't come here and you don't worship. You don't know what he does in his own house. You don't need to be under a physical structure to worship your God. As long as you believe to worship God. that, like, you know. Yes. And how did you know she, he didn't read the Bible? He didn't read scripture? Like, did he you go rampage his home? Like, yeah. Did you go through his But things? because he didn't physically come, it's like, oh. And I'm sure there's people out there like that. I'm, I'm glad Sarah. Sturge took Howie with him. Me no. too. Because she was... He was basically like, he's a good dude. Like, he was, what's your problem? He started feeling guilty once. Yes. Yeah. The she, one, I think the ones that eventually showed guilt, um, were, they're the true ones of faith. The ones like Bev, where she didn't have no guilt. She wasn't a woman of faith. She was a fake. And then she tried to escape ass. everything she believed in. Yeah. Then she tried to make a hole so she could hide it. I'm like, dude, that ain't gonna work. But it, it oh really reflected... God. Riley didn't want to hurt anybody. Yeah, his parents didn't want to. That's either. right. That's right. Yep. It did. It reflected, and then um, sheriff's son, and then how he, you know, was ah, that gets me emotional right now. How he wanted so bad to go to to mass with them, but then at the end he, he did. He, was it muscle? No. I think so. I think the muscle. Um, he was like doing the prayer of that. You know that. Going through that little ceremony. I mean, he or whatever. loved his dad. Oh yeah, that's what set it off was when don't screw with my dad. Like do not. That same with, I mean, you know, you don't do that with your family. Like, like don't. I mean, like uh, Monsignor with Aaron and and. Um, and then he put his hand on his dad when he was going. Yeah. I. I also feel bad. I know they escaped, and I'm glad. I feel bad because what do they do now? That's what I was thinking too. They like have nobody. They have nobody. And then and how... At least they have each other and it wasn't just one person in a boat. That's true. Well, and then how... What was his name? The brother, I forgot his name again, but... I don't his name. How he said to Ly Lisa, like, Wiley's... I mean, Riley's... My brother's dead too, right? I remember, mm -hmm. you know. Um, but he was never the one in denial. It was Annie. I didn't like her the previous one. I just... Once she pushed Aaron, she totally had, like... Uh-uh. But she redeemed herself in this one. And she took her own life rather than them taking mm -hmm. her life, right? Um, damn. That was good. Yeah. It was, may have been a jumper, but it was worth it to get through the show. Yeah, I, there was a lot of jumpers to me at, like, the first three, probably. Mm -hmm. And then not so much. It was more, like, intense or more. It wasn't so much jumpers. Um, with these last couple for me. You didn't look at all at the bar. It was just dead animals and stuff like that. No, I kind of was stuff. like, it's because when the light went out, I was like, oh my God, he's going to come out of somewhere. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It was just funny that she kept shooting him. He's like, go away. Go away. I know. <laughs> he's like, I'm busy. Go away. I know, right? It's like, well, that's good at least, right? 
um, man, this was a good, intense, and yes, jumpers, and a bit, um, yeah, I guess more, like, suspenseful, mm -hmm. like, right? Um, but very good. Two thumbs up for this whole series. Yeah. And, yeah, the previous episode, uh, um, yeah, I was a little mad. <laughs> there was some yelling and some hitting my sofa. Um, but it was it was definitely worth a watch. I'm glad we watched this. And they did such a good job. The guy that plays, I know he was an old Christine, so that's why he looks so familiar with... Uh, he was the brother. Yeah, he was the brother. He was just a goof ass. But to see him in this role, like completely different, mm -hmm. he did a really good job. And whoever plays Bev, Coop Man, you rocked it, girl, because... Punch we did in the not face, like pull you. your tone ponytail. Yes, and strangle you with it because, like, I think, like Danny said, if you can hate a character that much, they're doing a good job, right? Um, oh, and she's in the movie Hush with um, the lady who plays Aaron. Well, that's what you said because because her husband Aaron is married to the director of this show, Hill House by Manor. He also directed that one. Oh, that's cool. That's good. Oh, she plays an evil psychopath in that one too. No. <laughs> Oh, she was a whack job. Mm -hmm. um, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Um, no, when he was, when he saw the bird in the, how would the kids, uh, the kids, when uh, Riley's brother, at least I, remember, I thought I saw the face of Joe in there, but no, they had drowned him or something, mm -hmm. right? So no, some other guy. But um, how sad. They were just going around, like, just whoever they could get, even if they weren't, like, church goers. They didn't care. Mm -hmm. Oh. But yeah, so oh well, yeah, good, good, good episode. Anything else you want to say on this one? All right, we're gonna like try to recover from this emotionally because <laughs> this was an emotional one. So we're just gonna say it quick. You know, if you haven't, please subscribe to our channel. I don't like. I'm not gonna really beg because that's that's beneath me. But um, uh, please, please, <laughs> I, that's begging though, right? <laughs> um, no, it's not beneath me. But please, uh, please subscribe to our channel. Hit the. Well, all the links to our social media are in the in the description, so check those out. I don't think he'll ever emotionally recover from what I just watched. Oh, I, I know. You honestly cried more than I did in this one. Yeah. And I'm the crier in this family. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I very I wear like all my feelings like just on my sleeve, so I like. But I mean, to see that one really emotionally hit you, wow! It really was emotional, impactful. So. Um, but you know, we're, we're going to call it a night and, uh, we want to wish you a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in your part of the world. As always be kind. Don't be a Bev <laughs> until we meet again. Bye.